if we are talking about a group of cervical limb nodes and the muscle and the triangles so it is the angle of mandible and here is the mastoid stylomastoid process or mastoid process this is the clavicle and this is the hyoid bone so from beginning from the stylomastoid process to the clavicle there is a landmark of the muscle which is sternocleidoid mastoid muscle and posteriorly we have the trapezius muscle and suppose this is the midline in the neck so here is the muscle this is the anterior digastric muscle and this is the posterior digastric muscle and from here this is the superior belly of omohoid and this is the inferior belly of omohoid so first you can see there is a triangle which is known as mental triangle here is the limb node present which is known as submental limb node which is level 1a and this is the another triangle bounded by the inferior border of the mandible and posterior border of the anterior digastric and the anterior border of the posterior digastric which is level 1b and here is the limb node this is sub mandibular limb node so both are one level 1 limb node okay one thing this is the sternocleidomastoid muscle so from the sternocleidomastoid muscle to the anterior portion all are anterior triangle of the neck and from the post and from the posterior border of the sternocleidomastoid to the anterior border of the trapezius all are the triangle is known as posterior triangle okay okay so level 1 limb node is complete so from the from the beginning uh here is the sternocleidomastoid muscle and the stylomastoid mastoid process from the from the mastoid process to at the level of upper border of the hyoid bone and from the upper border of the hyoid bone to the no, sorry for upper one third middle one third and the lower one third so upper one third from the mastoid process start mastoid process to the upper border of the hyoid bone this is covered upper jugular or upper deep cervical limb node which is le level 2 and from the upper border of the hyoid bone to the middle one third this is level 3 or deep cervical limb node level 3 and from the rest lower is level 4 so level 4 limb node so level 3 level level 2 level 3 level 4 limb node and the posterior triangle which is covered the level 5 limb node and uh, the central or the midline midline most of the people are calling this is the pretracheal or paratracheal limb node this is the level 6 limb node sometime it is called as delphian limb node and the mediastinal limb node is also called the level 3 limb node so we are talking about the some of the triangle as well as the limb node Thank you.